No history of the 20th century would be complete without a chapter on Helmut Kohl. The story of his life in many ways captures the story of Germany and Europe, taking us from a time of great division and conflict in World War II to a time of great unity and prosperity today. Helmut Kohl was not simply a witness to this sea change with incomparable insight, courage, and fortitude. He led the way. When I awarded Helmut the Presidential Medal of Freedom in 1999, America's highest civilian honor and one rarely given to a non-citizen, I said that he ranks with Churchill, Roosevelt, and de Gaulle for the way he championed the unification of Germany, the unification of Europe, the way he strengthened our West Western alliance, and the hand of friendship he extended to Russia. Simply put, Germany, Europe, and indeed our 21st century world would not be the same without the leadership of Helmut Kohl. In thinking about Chancellor Kohl, along with his great public contributions, I'm also grateful for the personal bond that we formed when we worked together. I felt so close to him in our G8 meetings that I once said that most of my views on the issues could be summed up in four words. I agree with Helmut. We've shared some good meals and good times together. I hope we will in the future. I hope we'll do some more good things together. I am very grateful that Helmut Kohl was my friend and that I had a chance to serve with him. Once Chancellor Kohl said the visionaries are the true realists, Helmut Kohl's vision made possible a new reality, one full of promise and hope, and we are all the better for it.